I'm back. The Sultan, that is. Welcome to the BCS edition of the Sultan Saturday. And it's the most wonderful time of the year. Bowl season, of course. And if you have time in between games, see the family, give some gifts, and have a little something to eat, too. Now, let's get on to the games. Four big ones everybody's got their eye on. The BCS. Start with the Orange Bowl. Wake Forest out of the ACC. Louisville out of the Big East. Good matchup. Wake's a great story in college football. Louisville's offense is going to be too much for Wake to handle. This game won't be a blowout, but Louisville wins it in the end. Fiesta Bowl. This one's got everybody at home saying, ho-hum Fiesta Bowl, Oklahoma against that whack team, Boise State. Get ready, Sooner fans. 12-0 is 12-0. I don't care who you play. Boise State will give Oklahoma a game, but Oklahoma wins the game in the end for the Big 12 as the champ. Now, the granddaddy of them all, the Rose Bowl. And it's Michigan-USC, a classic Rose Bowl matchup. Who could ask for more than that? What do you say about this game? Who's going to win? As far as the players, the skilled players, Michigan really has better players with Henny and, and Hart as a running back. 27 to 20, Michigan. Go Blue, baby! Michigan takes it all! Woo! USC is going to take this over Michigan, and here's why. They're hungry after that loss to UCLA, so it's going to be booty, booty, booty everywhere, like my man Bubba Sparks said. I love the excitement of the bowl season. I love everybody else and how they get so excited. Uh, Julie, though, may need a little bit of help on the side. Regardless, I'm picking Michigan in this game. USC will be ready to play after losing to UCLA. Michigan's got something to prove, though. They think they belong in the national championship game. They're going to make a statement in this game. So the Sultan says, hail to the victors and the rest of the song, however it goes. Now. The Sugar Bowl returns home this year to New Orleans, which is a great story for anybody that loves football. LSU got snubbed out of the Rose Bowl, but good news for Les Miles and the gang. They play in the backyard against Notre Dame. Who do we think is going to win this one? Tell me. Get all the attention, Greg. Uh, LSU in a blowout. Notre Dame's had a really soft schedule. Only decent team they've beaten all year is Georgia Tech. Got blown out by USC and Michigan, the two best teams they've played. LSU's coming off a big win against Arkansas. I think they're going to take it 31-10. I'm a huge Notre Dame fan. I've been following them my whole life, but I am a realist, and I know LSU's got a really good team. Jamarcus Russell's a solid quarterback, and Notre Dame's defense just isn't as good. I think LSU's going to win. LSU is going to romp Notre Dame because Notre Dame doesn't have the physicalness or the speed that LSU does. I can't believe this. For the first time of the year, a consensus on the Sultan of Saturday? I'm going to make it a fourth. I agree with these guys. I don't think LSU blows out Notre Dame. I think Notre Dame's offense has the ability to put some points on the board, but I think they will be exposed by their schedule they had this year. Playing LSU, who I still think is one of the top three teams in the country, LSU wins at home in the Sugar Bowl. Doesn't hurt, they'll have the home crowd behind them. Now, first week of January, don't forget about me after the holidays and you wake up from your hangover after New Year's, the National Championship Edition of the Sultan of Saturday coming the first week in January. So, go to CSTV.com slash Sultan, send me your comments, or send me a video. Do it from the New Year's Eve party. I love stuff like that. But be careful if you drunk dial me, because remember on this show, I have the last word. Happy holidays from the Sultan. Enjoy the bowls.